Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to this, you know, beautiful channel. If you are new here, you are highly, highly welcome. Just relax, okay? Just relax. smash that red button that says subscribe. Um, after that, turn on your notification bell so to become part of this family, and that way be notified anytime I drop any new video. Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. and please, please, I beg you, remember to like this video, leave your comment down there on the comment section, you know, share the videos, subscribe, do all that good stuff, okay? And to my returning subscriber, Ndioman Jemba, my people, my people, Ndioman Jeko, Ndin Jeko. You guys are my G's, you guys are my people, you guys are the ones that, you know, encouraging me, gingering me to always make this video. Thank you guys. I don't take all of these things for granted. Um, it's not easy to stop by and watch somebody's video. I don't take them for granted. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. And I personally say that whatever you lay your hand that is good, the good Lord is going to bless you and everything you're doing thank you so much so guys without wasting most of your time without wasting much of your time let's dive into today's video um in today's video i want to check the bus more like hey so there's this video nj dropped yesterday in fact thank you nj banter with nj for you know hearing my advice for adhering my to my advice because Personally, I've been making video um, asking NJ come out and say like, you know, somehow what is the kind of your deal breaker in friendship um, come out and say things that, you know, that make you to fall out with Sandra, you know, we want to know details because personally, eh, I'm someone that admire good things and when good things fall out or did not work out, I try to know the reason why it did not work out because Personally, for me, I'll try to avoid those things because I'm too conscious of life. I don't live life um, anyhow. I live life intentionally. Uh, that one apart, okay? So, what I'm always telling angels that I know that, personally, I'm not saying that angel is perfect human being. But my instinct keep on telling me that angel cannot be the reason why this friendship didn't work out or is no longer working out. Do you get Let's even call it spare, spare. But their food we shall know they like the way NJ, you know, portrays herself, comports herself, do things on camera. Um, you can sense whether she's real or not. Like you can say that that is really who she is. You get. Mm -hmm. On the other hand, I'm not here, you know, to know but mask somebody or you know, I'm not here to judge. Who made me a judge? No, but. Let's tell ourselves the truth. We see all those trends. On the other hand, Sandra is someone that has already even said it a um, couple of her videos that she fights, um, she's this like that, she's built this way, she don't want to change. This, like, she comes out and she's proud of, you know, some of her bad behaviors. Like, she'll tell that this is the way she is. I'm not trying to say that Sandra is a bad person. No, nobody is perfect. Sandra has the good aspect of her. You see, in terms of giving, Sandra is very good because this is me for you. I see good in people. I see bad in people. Personally, me also, I'm not that perfect. I have my good side. I have my bad side. Like, everyone has a good side and bad side. But there are things that when it's becoming too much, you know, you need to strike a balance, okay? So, in this video, without talking much, mm, let me talk about um, NJ's video, video she dropped yesterday, where she titled the video, um, a kind of deal breaker for friendship, things that you will do. Um, she will no longer feel comfortable of being friends with you. Um, I wrote a lot, so I titled this video a kind of 20 evidence of the breaker in friendship. 20 evidence, yes, because I started counting at a point. I lost count, okay? So in one of her videos, the first, in that video, sorry, the first point she made is what? Competition, yes. No, the first thing she made was giving your all and she expects you giving your all back, okay? Now, in friendship, yes, even though that people cannot give up, but there are some, there are, 
and extend you will do something that person will know you value that friendship you are giving back once you can don't tell me i don't have i am poor you are rich this and that you know that you do that kind of stuff um even if i'm rich i'm giving you money you have other things you can give me you can give me your time you can give me your um support you can give me your advice you can be there for me like it's not under on the most that when i'm giving you money you give me money so giving and giving is also expected in a relationship not giving and taking only competition my dear that's the worst thing you can ever have um in a friendship if i if you have a friend that is so competitive with you my dear that person can even you know buy you in our uh, own way can send it to the other world because competition brings jealousy it brings a lot of things it shows is a sign of a healthy um relationship giving wrong advice yes there are a lot of friends that are good in that i've encountered this this is my friend she always gives me this wrong advice because she want me to fail she want me to see she want people to see me as a failure because she sees me like she sees that whatever i put my hands prosper so like she wants something that will draw me back bring me back you know that's again competition I'm happy that you have failed. There are some friends that are uh -huh, no more. If you enter a toxic relationship, eh, in fact, eh, your own don't finish you. Because they will come to your face, you know, pretend as if they are sympathizing with you, but at your back they are happy that you failed. I'm um, selfish. You know, people that are selfish, always them, then they always put themselves at first, forgetting the relationship, forgetting the friendship. In friendship, always put your friendship at first always you know make sure that you you portray that friendship in a healthy way emotionally and verbally abuse this is number seven emotionally and verbally abuse like i can't take that like people they emotionally blackmail you emotionally you know bring you down people that when you have an argument number eight you have an argument with them they will insult you and when you get back with them they still will not apologize ah uh, that is the sign of toxic relationship. Let me just tell you the truth. Um, I can't take that. I can't condone that. No, not me at all. Now, personally, I'm someone that does something intentionally. I don't do things because let me just do as life goes. No, I like if I have friend, I'm, I know the reason why I'm taking you as a friend. Okay, friendship that always give excuses for bad behavior. Oh, there's always an excuse for doing what you do. There's always an excuse for feeling the way you feel. There's always an excuse for the way you are reacting. And their um, reasons are always valid. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Sister, mm? they're always on point. They are always right. Sister, run away from such relationship. Having a friend that will constantly insult, talk trash about your family. No, no, no. Family is everything. I take my friend as my family, as part of my family. Let me just tell you the truth. So you talking down on my on my family, talking trash about my family. No, 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 no. It's like you're even talking trash about you because if you're my friend, you're automatically my family. You're automatically part of my family. So, and I don't joke with my family or blood, number one. Uh-uh. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Because no matter how um, friends we are, no matter how good we are, one bad thing happens is the your family that will be number one to you know be there for you sometimes friends will not even shop it's family that is always there so don't don't i don't joke with my family having friends that gossip mm -mm -mm -mm, i don't take they will come into your um, your presence pretend they are with you but at your back they talk about you sometimes they pretend i'm seeking advice from people to get their opinion uh -uh, don't go don't go there okay you're not a friend you are you are you are, you are not a friend because can sit down one place just show for me not friendship that openly correct you like they want to tell people i can you know them correct this person even with their money even with all the all the things they have i can talk down on these people they openly correct you they want to feel that they are they know it all they want to tell people that you are wrong all always friends that talk down about you about your religions mm -mm -mm. If i have people i have friends with that are muslim that are christian that are, um, pentecostals like i don't care about your religion provided it's not affecting me provided you're not talking bad about my own provided your behavior doesn't affect me or affect my own friends that lies no 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 that is a red, a red flag friends that can't keep secret mm -mm. That, then why are you my friend if you can't keep secret if you can't keep my secret you pretend you're my friend you go at my back and tell people about my secret and uh, physical abuse mm -mm. i don't take it having a friend that wants constant 
um, that want to constantly pick fight with you. Mm -mm. Why are we friends? Are we friends to fight? We're friends for, you know, goodies, good time, good things. Having friends that never keep time agreed um, for something. Like we plan to do something, you go ahead and there's a good without telling me. Like, it's like... You are telling me that I can do it without you. I don't need you in my life, okay? Um, at this point, we're in 19. Having friendship that, um, friends that talk anyhow to elders. Mm -mm, I can't take that. If you can't respect people now, people will think that that's the way we roll. Because show me your friend and I'll tell you who you are. Don't bat 20 those that think that their opinion matters without giving yes to your own opinion. I can't, like... Personally, Angel is like me. I'm someone that I give all and I expect all. Like when I'm your friend, eh? Hey, you will enjoy you. I'm putting my money, my energy. I fight for my friends. You cannot even talk that. Like, secretly, who are you that I'm your friend, eh? And somebody will come and badmouth you in my presence, even while you are not there. My dear, they know even feel. They live and not even feel because they know that I am always there to defend my friend. So, personally, I think that when you find this strength, um, people or people you call your friends, you be very careful. It's a red flag. It's a red flag, please. You be, you should be very careful because, especially competition. Competition is very, very unhealthy. And um, friendship is very, very unhealthy trait on, on friendship. Please be very careful because competition can lead to a lot of things. Competition can lead to jealousy. Jealousy can lead to, you know, permanent somebody. Jealousy can lead to somebody. So, guys, like, I have to end this video here. Please remember to like, comment, share because a lot of other videos are coming, okay? And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!